Yeah, shalom. All honor, praise, and glory unto Yahweh Basham, Yahweh Chai, Basham Rakakadash. Big up all of the Akiam, the brethren, who I help push 100% root and the sister them to the Aquax. A double honor to the elder them at the Great Millstone, who I teach and I push it too. Alright, so we are going to talk about the whole world right now is turning against America. But the American people can't, don't realize it as of yet. And that go into um, Revelation. 17 and 16 and the ten horns which thou sawest upon the beast these shall hate the heart and shall make her desolate and naked and shall eat our flesh shall burn it with fire so the ten horns is talking about the eu and nato and the heart is talking about america right we have got proof to the ten horns that talk about nato because the first 10 countries were far nato of the european union side are the Tenons, being Iceland, Norway, England, Denmark, Netherlands, Belgium, Luxembourg, France, Portugal, and Italy. Them, them country there are the, are the Tenons, which are going to hate the har, right? And forget the har, we have to understand who the har is, Babylon. Revelation 17 and 5. And upon our forehead, the har was, was a name written, Mystery Babylon the Great, the mother of all harlots and abominations of the earth. So that's all you, you know, so the R is Babylon, right? And we are going to get the characteristics for describe Babylon. And that going to Jeremiah 51 and, and 1. Hold on. Thus saith the Lord, Yahweh, Behold, I will raise up against Babylon and against them that dwell in the midst of them that rise up against me and destroy and win. That's why you get all of the tiny those. What well, happening in America right now? <clears throat> right? So it's talking about Babylon. Verse verse 13. Oh, thou that dwellest upon many waters, abundant in treasures, thine end is come, and the measure of thy covetousness. So Babylon, the great heart, with the ten hands, the NATO will, will burn with fire. Them them dwell upon many waters. Babylon dwell upon many waters. Or oh, you look upon a, a United States military base worldwide map, right? It show you say America have a, have a military base upon many waters, every ocean, every sea, every continent, right? Everywhere in the world, every, upon the four corners, upon many peoples. That's how you know say Babylon is America, though that dwells upon many waters, right? He, he's a proud man. Neither can he stay at home, like like a back up to a uh, 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 Micah say, them covered fields with violence. NATO, United States coalition, bombing. Right? So with the news articles, we see in France, right? They now talk about it on the internet. They must say, oh, the French are protesting democracy, democracy. No, the French people are, are protesting for exit out of NATO. That's what the protests are about. From, from, from 2008, people in France have been calling for, for, the, for Europe to make their own military alliance excluding America, right? Fr the French call for NATO exit in 2022. In, a, in a 2023, France was second week of anti-NATO protests. So the French people, which are the leaders of the European Union, are, are calling for, for European independence from American, American alliances. E even Germany, people are focused upon, upon Macron the, the French president uh, upon his upon his arm, um, his comments that America need that Europe need to distance itself away from America, but them now focus upon Germany. Merkel said the same thing. The the German German Chancellor Angela Merkel on Tuesday endorsed the creation of an EU army, siding with French President Emmanuel Macron, whose similar call in recent days drew a facilitate of wrathful tweets from U.S. President Donald Trump. Merkel threw our support behind the idea and address to the European Parliament, part of a series of leader speeches on the future of Europe. John claude Juncker already said that the common European army would show the world that there would never be, never again be a war in Europe, Merkel said, referring to the European Commission president who was in the Parliament chamber. So you have Macron and you have Germany, two of the biggest members of the EU NATO, are calling for an exit from NATO, of NATO from American alliance, right? Yeah, yeah. Then you have the man himself say it himself. 
France Macron urges Europe to reduce the dependency on United States, stay away from Taiwan conflict. French President Emmanuel Macron asserted that Europe must reduce its dependency on the United States to avoid getting dragged into China, Taiwan conflicts. All right, so we see the ten arms, the, the NATO EU alliance, them already are called for withdraw themselves away from America, the har. The, the ten arms are, are already beginning to hit the har. Right? Look upon this right here from Daily Daily Wood. Daily Hood. When it comes to global dependence on the dollar. Macron specifically says Europe should lower its need to rely on the extraterritoriality of the United States dollar. If the tensions between two superpowers eat up, we will have time nor resource to finance our strategic autonomy and we will become vassal. So Europe is telling them they need to even back themselves away from the United States dollar. Just like the BRICS nation and the 100 nations in our um, project operation Sandman, Right, Europe is involved in that too. Right, Europe is involved with dropping the dollar. The whole world right now is dropping the dollar, but the American people cannot see what I'm going. And that going to Obadiah 1 and 7. All the men of thy confederacy have brought thee even to the border. The men that were at peace with thee have deceived thee and prevailed against thee. They that eat thy bread have laid a wound under thee. There is none understanding in him. Now she fix. So, so, so the people will eat America bread, right? The people will get the foreign assistance, the foreign aid, the foreign military assistance from America. Them, them, them take the money from America and know them all against America. That's what it mean by they that eat thy bread. I've laid a wound under thee. There is none understanding in them. And the people in America can't see that the whole world is turning against them. Right? The, the people here cannot see that. The pride of them have deceived them. You have to remember, say, America gives $685 million of assistance to Europe and Asia. And these countries are now joining along with China and, and Russia against America. The same people will feed them. Right, uh, the, 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 um, America spend eight hundred billion pan 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 war every 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 year, and, and another additional three hundred and eighty billion pan euro, and Europe get get all of this money, and them I say, yo, we need to distance ourselves. After them get the money, them say, yo, we need to distance ourselves away from America. You understand? Uh, and America people care. See the whole world depend this type of type of energy we have. You see me? In a Obadiah 1 and 3, the pride of thine heart have deceived thee. Though that dwellest in the cleft of the rock, whose habitation is I, that saith in his heart, who shall bring me down to the ground? So the American people say, oh, America forever. You understand? It never has to crumble. The dollar always has to stay upon top. The pride of them heart have deceived them. Them things say it's a World War II, 1945, when America dip upon top. But they don't realize that everywhere in America you have a drug out neighborhood. You have, you have transsexuals, man, them and, and teach the little picnic them off and strip and, and dance. Right? You have, you have bad man music everywhere. Right? You have, you have GMO, mRNA, food. You see me? The pride of them heart have deceived them. You, you, see, the, you see China a facilitate peace in the Middle East between Iran and, and Saudi Arabia. And that peace in the Middle East between Iran and Saudi Arabia will end the fighting in Yemen and Oman. We will, will team up the whole of the Arabian Peninsula and Iran against, against Israel and America. People can't see it. We're in the Bible, man. It's in the Bible. You understand? Saudi Arabia makes proposal for Yemen after you who they talk. Them man, they have been having a, a big war for some year now, which is causing famine in the land. And people for starve and know them attack, but yo, let's end all of that. Yemen, Oman, let's end all of that. Peace. Peace in the Middle East. And, and America mad. Because them have found peace in the Middle East, America sent nuclear submarines for, for, for um, intimidate them people. It show you say America is against world peace. If them can't rule over the world, there shall be no peace. You understand? 
Uh, but them can't stop it because everything will happen, everything that's happening is prophecy in the Bible. And I'm going to second Ezra 15 and 29 to so that Saudi Arabia and, and Iran and the whole Arabian Peninsula would have came up. It just day in the Bible. Second Ezra 15 and 29. Where the nations of the dragons of Arabia shall come out with many chariots, and the multitude of them shall be carried as the wind upon the earth, that all which hear them may fear and tremble. Right? So so that's the Saudi and, and, and the and the Houthis and the Yemeni and the Omani and, and, and the Arabian United Emirates and and, and Deja Houthi and that's the whole of them all team up together. Right? Verse 30. Also the Carmenians. Right? So now you have another faction that will team up with them. Also the Carmenians raging in wrath shall go forth as the wild boars of the wood. And with great power shall they come and giant Baku with them. Them are going to team up with the, 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 the dragons of Arabia. And shall waste a portion of the land of the Assyrians. That are the Israelis and the, and the Americans. Right? And when you look on the map, it shows you say Carmenia is Iran. Carmenia is a region of Persia, media, Iran. Them all talk about the same thing when you see media go up for Elam, go up for Persia, Gog and Magog with Persia, uh, uh, the, 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 the Shusha. You see me? All talk about the same thing. Carmenia, Persia, Susha, media, Elam, all at the same place. And them are going to team up. With, with the Arabians for come against for come to team up with Russia and China and, and, and Europe and them all go, and them all go team up against America and Israel. You see me? Revelation 18 and 7. Oh oh how oh much have she glorified herself and lived deliciously. So much time and thanks are give her for she saith in her heart, I am I sit a queen and I'm no widow and shall see no sorrow. So America say yo nobody can touch this man. Nobody can run up and run up on me. I sit, I sit royal. Nobody can touch me. I shall never see any pain. But the pride of them heart have deceived me. Because verse 8. Therefore shall our plagues come in one day. Death and mourning and famine. And she shall be utterly burned with fire. For strong is the Lord God who judges her. Right? So, so that go back into, into Revelation 17 and 16. And the ten horns, the EU NATO, which thou sawest upon the beast, they shall hate the heart, and shall make her desolate and naked, and shall eat her flesh and burn her with fire. So Europe will burn America with fire, right? Second is just 15 and 30. <clears throat> also the Carmenians raging in rap shall go forth with the wild boars of the wood, they are dragons of Arabia, and with great power shall they come and join back with them. And shall waste a portion of the land of the Assyrians. We're going to Babylon. Another term for Babylon. So, so, so it's a go down, man. It's a go down for America, man. Just like in you know, um, the Pirates of the Caribbean, right? You have, you have Lord Beckett uh, uh, the, with, with him ship the Endeavor. Uh, and, and him thinks say him on the side of David Jones' ship. So, when David Jones and Captain Jack Black Pearl come, the, the, the man, Lord Beckett, say, Oh, the, 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 the Dutchman survived. With the pan side. But then the Dutchman turn around and come pan 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 Lord Beckett and the Endeavour with, with Captain Jack Pirate Ship and then and then both sides of them destroy the, the endeavor. And that's what go happen with America. You have on one side the Arabians and the Carmenians and Russia and China. And then on the next side you have the, the European Union and NATO. All are coming pan America, man. You understand? But but Obadiah one and, and three. The, pr the pride of thine heart have deceived thee. Them can't see it. Thou that dwellest in the cleft of the rock, whose habitation is high, that saith in his heart, Who shall bring me down to the ground? Them man, they can't see what I go on. Them can't see what, what, what both for pop off in the world. You understand? So that's what we want to talk about. Shalom, peace, and